now we will start with <coughs> oracle networking now you are already familiar with networking concept okay whenever the word networking is coming means one server is there and with the help of lan cable and a lan card you can say using all the things which required for a network hardware infrastructure you required one server you required lan card you required a lan cable and a jacks all those things okay server side you require one operating system that is related to server that is unix linux okay these are all related to server side operating system windows 2008 server these are all operating system and client side you require xp 98 these are all client side but in linux you will have only linux client side as well as on server side just the rights will be different he will have complete rights as a linux administrator and this linux person will have limited rights just we are creating user and assigning some rights okay so before going to oracle networking your operating system network should be okay all lan cables port number ip address these are important okay after that only your oracle networking will work on that network if your linux operating system network problem is there your oracle networking will also disconnected you can say now why the concept of oracle networking is there in between because of security reason see if the thing is if through lan cable you can access each other computers by uh, using ip address and all those things so my oracle database will also come in sharing if your operating system is coming so my oracle database will also come in sharing so because of that security reason oracle has kept his own networking concept unless and until you don't configure your oracle file you can't connect to database a normal user if i if i am creating a user like production production finance finance after creating my network should be there oracle network should be there okay that concept is means listener file is there one of the listener file is there if listener file is started after database is starting you have to start your network also if you want to allow your oracle users to connect with your database if i start the database if i don't start my networking oracle networking that is listener file a user cannot connect to me my database is in up mode open mode but my users can't connect so after each and every day as a dba first you have to start your database then you have to start your network then only my uh, the clients or users will connect to me okay so as we were working in sys no network structure is there that's why we are moving from one user to another user without networking also but in real time where there is a networking so from client side some different concept is there to connect with my database that concept we will be learning in this chapter okay so what will be the concept on a server this is the this is the concept about this lan cables operating system concept but for oracle i have to configure my two files one client side one server side on server side i will specify my details of database to my networking then i will assign that particular name network name to my client so that my client can connect to me by using that particular name that that is nothing but a listener name and here the you can say tns name that is my ip address all those things port number hmm? so here you can now these files that what i am talking about listener and tns these files are provided by oracle and by default it is available in this admin folder this admin folder that is available inside network db1 this complete path 
under this folder you will find one of the file listener.ora okay and the client side file is also provided by oracle that is tns names.ora which is there in admin both are in available in admin okay one database can have more than one listener i can create this listener names n number of listeners because with the help of one listener my traffic will not work so i will create different listeners for different users okay now what will be the setting we have to do in that listener file listener name should be there listener host name my computer name my own server name or ip address you can say host name or ip address you can say hmm? ip number then port number by default 1521 is the port number default it runs on 1521 but you can change the port number we can define port number between 1024 to 65000 then my sid name will be there that bash profile inside bash profile what i have specified the sid na then here you can use that so these are the listener settings and client side alias name whatever the means client name you can say then listener host name listener port number and listener sid name so that i can connect to my data uh, that's server first i have to configure myself then only my can client connect to my computer now to connect with server right now what i am doing i am moving with sys user if i move with sys user i can move to any other user by giving connect because i am already in my database already on my pc on my server but the actual thing in real time i will move with sys but my client cannot move with sys and move to his user i will not allow the client to move first with sys then to his user means indirectly i am giving whole sys portion to him so he should not move with sys he should move with his own user only so the syntax to connect with my database will be like this sql plus his username production production at the rate that alias name what i will configure in this file i will give just alias name to my client so he will connect to my database but not come to in my database right now what i am doing i am going in sys then moving to that production indirectly i am if you want to go production means you are working in sys only right now what i am doing but that is not the correct concept i will move with sys and my client will move with his own username password but using alias name to connect to my ip address i will allow okay alias name which is defined in tns names dot ora clear so this is the concept simple two files we have to open and types that uh, configuration uh, lines okay the lines i will type in front of you first what i will do root user i will go and check my ip address i will assign my ip address or my computer name i have to check what name is there in this particular pc no 
for Linux. network hmm? first operating system is important na? yeah ethernet ethernet inactivity is huh? it is inactive I have to activate it first okay just double click on that particular LAN card hmm? Subnet mask is the two fifty five two fifty five no default gateway address same one ninety two argument it is hmm? Hmm? that one Hmm? we will move again to that user this IP I have to use in that listener file app oracle product 0 db1 and then network admin ok here you will find on this pc it is samples say listener.ora and tns names.ora Hmm? Yeah, these two files one is on other terminal I will configure and one this terminal like that hmm? but in real time in admin folder it is a huh? that file not in samples here at the time of installation that folder has been created otherwise you will find in admin so what I will do these are my original files I will not disturb these files if any configuration problem is there with me no? I will make a copy of this file and I will configure in that and check it ok to make a copy cp command we are using in linux cp listener ok dot ora where I will make it on home directory I will make the copy it's starting in home directory means here on this home huh? on this so tilde sign I can use to make copy of to home directory so my copy has been there now same way I will take tns names dot ora huh? ok finish 
I will come out from this directory ls I will find those files now here if any problem I can again make original copy here clear uh, actually more lines are there if you go here now some too much lines are there in this file okay this see how big in the file like this hmm? I what I will do I will remove all these things hmm? I will remove all these things just press DD escape uh, DD just next time DD DD you press press D just press D lines will delete it okay now I will put some lines the configuration lines I will put here okay so the first I am deciding that allies name what I have told you now any name you can give like this suppose list of RCL list ABC list Oracle I have given for example hmm? now here you can write the some lines we have to type here huh? description underscore list equal to okay that two one is the default I can change also no problem okay call db na call db na our sid name call na cold uh, the text nine characters error uh. work again I have to show it where is my that home what I have shown in bash profile now in network again I have to show it this Oracle home so these are some lines I have inserted I will explain you in description at the important is address protocol TCP host port so, and here SID name and Oracle home okay just we will save it hmm? clear now how to test this file whether it is correct or not we can start the listener till now it is off I have just written the code now I can start the listener to start the listener lsn rctl the command is lsn rctl okay start and list orcl that allies name hmm? linux on linux you have to give this command networking all settings are in linux on sql no setting is there ping for client i will check tns ping i will use for client 
for server side this is starting first your network should start means like a ear it is now he can listen to your client listener is nothing but like ear you can say in books you will find like symbol ear symbol they are giving see listener failed to start ah huh? what is telling starting bin missing listener name list of rcl in listener dot ora okay at top we have given this name na that name we have to use here and that name is not getting na because i have used their underscore below that just a minute in bash profile one setting is remaining because we have not added for the first time because it was not required at that time but for networking i have to specify this parameter in bash profile that is tns admin equal to dollar oracle underscore home or that ora ng app oracle product that one hmm? save it what i will do i i have to execute huh, this bash profile whenever i am changing it correct na once you have started at the time of shutdown only you will stop mm. network once you start your server you mm. start your network also mm -hmm. so you will shut down your network first then your database no, no, say this listener ha huh? it has a specific time for what for listen no. Like, no no, no. it's in your hand start up and shut down mm -hmm. if you once a start up it will in a start mode only mm -hmm. if you shut down all the users will disconnect with you mm -hmm. even if my database is up mm -hmm. and listener is down mm -hmm. my network will disconnect mm -hmm. that's why we have to once we have started we have to start it
so I will give some other name any name you can give but there huh? not important he should show the IP address listener ok configured like that past networking that message we should come but these two files is related to networking but done by DBA not by Linux administrator Missing list now. Wars list wars here now. Where are you? Where are you? Product D B the actual problem maybe that because of spaces na sometimes it gives that space also and at last you should not keep the blank line huh? here it was the blank line that blank line is also included sometimes editor gives the problem that so i have removed that blank line last one huh?
अदरवाइज इन टेक्स्ट नो चेंज इज देर आई हैव नॉट चेंज एनी थिंग इन जस्ट लिसनर नेम आई वॉज ट्राइंग गिविंग अदरवाइज नो प्रॉब्लम ओके